Hey everyone, it's me. Um, I'm back again with a rant. Um, I haven't done one in a long time. <laughs> uh, so yeah, this time there's no Walker Sieges um, gameplay since it's not, um, I guess I could say it's not like, um, it's not on rotation right now. Uh, right now is Grand Conquest. But I use Rival Domains because this is, um, gameplay was, uh, uh, recorded, um, before Grand Conquest, so yeah, I bet you all would be wondering, well, is there, who are you uh, ranting on? Well, who I'm ranting on as of right now is this girl named Ramen. This is a gotcha tuber with 12,000 subscribers and there's been a lot of drama surrounding her, and there's just something I want to say about it, and uh, how I think she shouldn't deserve all her subscribers. So, I'll go to explaining who she is. Okay, so Ramen is a gacha tuber with um, almost 3,000, uh, um, not 3,000, sorry about that, that is 13,000 subscribers, and she creates a bunch of videos which are almost, um, barely to, uh, a minute long. They're very short. Um, yeah. Okay, so there's a reason why she, uh, got popular for it. She, there was this Laura issue with, um, gotcha tubers, and there was this person called Laura who was apparently messaging these gotcha tubers in Discord, and she was studying them without, um, anybody knowing her very discord name what ended up happening is that she um did something with her fans and forcing them to attack someone quote unquote she said it was a joke okay i don't know about you but i don't think that was supposed to be a joke she then got thrown onto r slash gotcha life fringe She made a big fuss about it. She, uh, she actually deserved to be there. I will give you guys my comment what I put on her video. She, uh, what I did is, I'll, I'll also read it out loud. Honestly, you deserved it. You said hate and no way in vain you said it was a quote unquote joke. You didn't clarify it. So technically you deserved it. And I just said used to because they're going to hate me, but like, I don't care. She technically deserved it. Okay, she made a big fuss about it, and then, um... She made the, you got it meme twice. This is a very big brain move. Okay, so now that we have a idea of who she is and what type of person she is, um, she's ter a terrible person, let's get on to what drama she was involved in. Okay, there was the first part of drama that ended up sparking up is um, she got into drama because of the r slash after like cringe post because she sent people to attack someone. So yeah, she um, there's a bit of more. She had to we have to apologize to three people. She apologized to someone who she two people actually no all of them have been threatened to be to go kill themselves. All of them. These are people on the, on the internet. And it could be very sensitive. She made three apologies. All three of them accepted it. And um, it's not mine to apologize. But I think they should know how to accept it. So let's get to the first part of drama. She got involved in. She got involved with a comment. Who she forced her fans to attack. As a quote unquote joke. She told them that. Oh you guys attack this person please. Ha 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 It's a joke. Ha 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 ha. But they told they frightened this person to kill themselves. How is that a joke? Second one. So she got into more drama again and she got someone to threaten she also threatened this person to go kill himself. Again, why? And this last piece of drama is the reason why I have completely lost disrespect. Respect, I should say, respect of her, and she just became very, very disrespectful, and she should not have all these support. So, here we are to the big drama, which I want to cover about. 
Okay, so I may have not be as loud as before, but I apologize because my parents are asleep right now. So what ended up happening is that with um Amari and Ramen, they got into a bit of a um I guess it's just a drama, but um what happened is that Amari was not in a good state of mind. And what even happened was that when Ramen uh attacked this um he or she, I don't remember the gender. I'm very sorry. When they, uh, when she attacked them, she, they made the mental state go down. And basically, they tried to commit suicide. They are, I believe, in the hospital right now, from what I know about this drama. They are in the hospital and they are not doing well, I hope. But she pulled an apology and said that oh um please forgive me i am very sorry for my actions and stuff like that i'm in online school so like sorry she said sorry three times but um what i do think she could have done better was make a formal apologies after she was done with online school because honestly the formal apology could have done better than just oh i'm going to um apologize and this will be all over i mean amari did um apologize um amari is i believe sister um forgave her so because amari told her i guess and so the drama ended but um what i could have seen done better was that um ramen did a formal apology right after so yeah i just wish for that but i'm not the one who was victimized so, here are my final thoughts on her. Okay, my final thoughts on Ramen is that I thought she was a good person. I thought that her channel was interesting. But now, now, I don't have any respect for her. She has lost all my respect and um, I don't think she deserves all these subscribers. So, I think she's a terrible person. Um... She said that she. I think the drama is all over now, but um, I will. Uh, I'm not the one to forgive her because of her actions. Um, I wasn't involved in any drama. I wasn't, I should say. But I, either if I was a victim, I probably wouldn't had a accepted her apology, just because. Um, yeah, I just um, wouldn't accept that apology so yeah this is my word thank you for watching and let me hear your opinion out here as a bunch of ramen fangirls attack me